Hello everyone, this is Shake from Visual Paradigm. Today I'm going to do a demonstration on our online sequence diagram tool. The online drawing tools are brought under the repository, our cloud service. If you have not subscribed to it yet, you can subscribe after watching this video. And I've included a link in the description of this video. Alright, let's begin. So this is the dashboard of repository. What I have to do is to open the diagram module first. This is the online diagram tool. On the left hand side, you can see a list of diagram types. We are going to create sequence diagram, so I select sequence diagram here. You can create a blank sequence diagram or to create from one of these templates. In this demonstration, I'm going to start from a blank diagram. So I click on this button. This is a blank sequence diagram. On the left hand side of the diagram, there is a list of diagram tools you can select in creating the diagram. There are lifelines, combined fragments, actors, and various connectors. I'm gonna start by creating a lifeline first. Select a lifeline, drag it onto the diagram. Name it. I name it payer, and with text payer as classifier. Resize it. This is a lifeline. I'm going to create another lifeline from this lifeline. What I have to do is to move my mouse pointer over this lifeline. Once I've done this, there are several triangles buttons appear around the lifeline. I press on one of them, drag it out, release the mouse button. This is the resource catalog. The resource catalog displays the available types of shapes that you can create from the source. In this case, we can create a lifeline with a message connector, a lifeline with a duration message, a lifeline with a create message, etc. In this case, we are going to create um, a general lifeline with a general message. So we select this resource. This creates a new lifeline with a sequence message connecting to it. Name the lifeline payment gateway with bank as classifier. Again, resize it. You can double click on the sequence message to enter its caption. Create one more lifeline. This time name it receiver text receiver. Resize it. Again give the sequence message a name. Connect the activation. Select this activation and connect it to the next one. Next, create an alternative combined fragment that covers the three lifelines. Create messages in the operand. You can specify the guard condition of an operand by double-clicking on it and entering the guard. So we've completed this diagram. I'm going to save it. Name the diagram, tax payment, and confirm. Okay, I want to export this diagram to an image. So I select file and then export. Keep the settings unchanged and then export. And this is the export image. This is the end of this video. If you're interested in drawing diagrams online, we invite you to subscribe to Vpository. I've included a link of Vpository in the description of this video. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.